Shout out to the KJ fam and welcome to Kristen and Jamil. We're back, you guys, for another fit review. Woo! But not just any review. What? You guys, this time we actually went to Wendy's and ordered in person and got the big bacon cheddar cheeseburger. We got it right this time, guys. Yes, we did. Well, when I say we, I mean Kristen did because she was ordering. A few, <laughs> a few videos ago, we door dashed it, or yeah. Jamil door dashed it, yes. and got the wrong burger. Yeah. Um, but so we, they say. <laughs> but we got the right one this time. Um, so we're going to be reviewing the big bacon cheddar cheeseburger, which actually looks really good. It does. And we also got some Baconator fries. I don't know if those are new or not, but yeah, we never got them before, so we're going to review those really quick. Cool. Um, so before we dive into the food, mm -hmm. um, I want to say what's on it. Okay, cool. Um, so basically, this uh -huh. burger is a quarter pound of fresh, never frozen beef covered in creamy cheddar cheese and bacon jam topped with applewood smoked bacon, crispy onions, and a slice of American cheese all on a pillow soft toasted cheddar bun. That's legit. We're calling it our cheesy bacony masterpiece, but you can just call it delicious if you want. <laughs> okay, so you can get single, double, or triple. Mm. Um, a single is 810 calories. Is it really? Yes. That's crazy. No, it's cray. So Kristen got a single, I got a double. And a um, double, want to know what your double is? I'm guessing 900 calories. 1,120 <laughs> calories. Sounds about right. And a triple is 1,420 calories. Okay. So this thing is not, for, not the, light. for the faint of calories. It's not. Yes. But it might be if you need calories, <laughs> if you're in calories, then you can eat this, you know? Yes. Yeah, so, yes. Back. I got the single, but it looks really hearty. It does. And I love this, you know, this little cheddar bun. Uh -huh. I mean, that's got to be good. It's got to be good. I hope so. People say it's good. Yes. So, let's see. We have quite a few people saying you got to try it. So, here we go. One, two, two three. three. Oh, I was literally trying to stop that. Sorry. Jamil had a little spilled <laughs> on his shorts. I was trying to. It's over. You had a drip. It's over. Okay. All right, let me try one more bite. Yeah. I don't know how I feel about it. Yeah, me neither. <laughs> me neither. Okay. All right, one more. I'm not a big fan of this. Um, it it tastes as though it's it's missing some flavor. Like I don't really taste. I can't taste any. Nothing stands out in taste. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. It seems like you would think with the bacon, with the you know the crispy onions, and even the cheddar bun, mm -hmm. something would be dominant, but it's not. Mm -hmm. It all just kind of blends in together. Mm -hmm. But. Even the, even with the sauce, there's like a sauce on here too, or the jam, the bacon jam. But it's it's not standing out. Yeah, I feel like a lot of people said that this was like their favorite burger, mm. and they said it was really really delicious. Mm. Maybe I was expecting like a wow, mm -hmm. but I'm not feeling a wow with this. Um, I think because I well we had the bourbon one recently, mm -hmm. and I feel like this is kind of. Similar, but not as sweet. Mm -hmm. And I feel like you almost want that a little more. I don't know. So mm -hmm. it's not bad at all. Like, it's fine. Yeah. Um, but it's also not, like, the best. Yeah. In my opinion, mm -hmm. this is going to taste best with a sauce. If you have a sauce on it, mm -hmm. then at least you'll have a dominant flavor mixed with the cheese and everything else that, like, really does. T I mean, it, I don't want to say it, it tastes good, but it's, like... I don't know, something about the cheese that's like comforting, you know, mm -hmm. to have that with something else. I don't know what I'm trying to what say. What kind of a sauce, like, do you <laughs> okay, think? Okay, so we have the ghost pepper sauce. That one might be good. Uh -huh. The sauce, some sauce might be good, too. Mm -hmm. A barbecue sauce. To be honest, if this had barbecue sauce on mm -hmm. it, it probably would make this burger. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I think. Because it does have that crispy onion ring, and yeah, and it has a little bit of sweetness with that, with that jam, mm -hmm. but I feel like it does need, like, a little extra, too. Yeah, it's okay, though. It's not bad. Yeah. I just don't, I don't think it's my fave. Yeah, I feel the same. 
it's weird. Yeah. I would have thought this has so much stuff on it. I would have mm -hmm. thought that it really, mm -hmm. something would stand out in mm -hmm. that flavor, but yeah. it just doesn't. It's fine. Um, yeah. I like the bun. You do? Yeah. Let me it's try cool. the bun by itself. The bun's cool. What's not to like? It's toasted cheddar. Yeah, maybe there's too much cheddar. Yeah. <laughs> that sounds crazy, mm -hmm. but maybe there's too much cheddar going on here. Or um, there's crispiness. I like the bacon. I like those crispy onions because you know me and the onion. I love it. Yes, me too. But yeah, I don't know. It's okay. Mm -hmm. What do you give it? I don't want to tell. It's okay. It's hard to describe. It's fine. It's it's almost like flavorless. <laughs> it's like it's like it's a wannabe barbecue bourbon. burger or barbecue yeah it's a wannabe bourbon almost or wannabe barbecue mm -hmm. but it's just like kind of missing that last sweetness of the barbecue sauce or that bourbon sauce that's how i feel about it so does that yeah. make sense like mm -hmm. if you get that bourbon burger without the bourbon sauce you're probably gonna get this flavor so that's kind of how i feel about it yeah mm -hmm. i give I it a seven a seven it's good it's just not like wow yeah i actually agree with you I think what it was was, mm -hmm. like I said, we had a lot of people that were saying it's like really good, their their favorite. Mm -hmm. So that kind of made me think that automatically this is just going to be, at best, very good. Mm -hmm. But after trying it, it isn't what I expected essentially. Mm -hmm. But it's not bad. It's still very eatable. I love Wendy's. It's probably one of my favorite fast food places to go. Mm -hmm. This is probably not my. This wouldn't be my favorite burger. Mm -hmm. Um. Well, it's a good burger. It's a good burger though. Mm -hmm. It's still a good burger. Yeah. So I'm gonna I'd give it I'd give it a seven too. Mm -hmm. I think I'm gonna give it a seven to be mm -hmm. honest. Mm -hmm. Because it's not really it's not bad. It's just not what I expected. Sure. I think that's what it comes down to. Yeah. And who knows? Maybe we didn't get the hype. We might have felt differently, but yeah, it's okay. Mm -hmm. I think we like mm -hmm. the bourbon one better. Even if you haven't got the bacon bourbon one, yes. uh, get that one. Mm -hmm. okay. However, uh -huh. while you're getting that ready. Yeah. This is 100% our opinion. <laughs> I always Which, want to say that's that. that's all that matters in life. It's <laughs> Kristen and Jamil's if opinion. If you're not listening to our opinion, you know, no one else matters pretty much, no. <laughs> but honestly, though, it is just our opinion. Um, you know, everyone has different okay. taste buds. I definitely would recommend still trying it. See what you think of it. Um, in fact, we love hearing that feedback because mm -hmm. it lets us know that you know, essentially that maybe, you know, the, I don't know what it lets us know, but. That there's, that there's people with lesser taste. No, I'm totally kidding. There's other tastes like out there. You like me today. I know, I'm totally kidding. There's people with lesser taste in this world, and we just can't handle it. No, no. no. That sounds totally like. Totally good. You've been hanging around me too long. I know. These jokes. <laughs> That's something I would say. <laughs> no, but it just it just lets us, you know, it's it's nice to hear other it opinions. It is, it is. And I and I can see why yeah. people do like it. Yeah. yeah. Okay. We okay. have gotten this before. Oh, we have? Yeah, the bacon uh, and fries. It's really just fries with some melted cheese and bacon on top. Got it. But we have this ghost pepper sauce. Ooh. And I kinda want you to pour that on here. If okay. You, if you want. You've had this before. You know the ghost pepper sauce, right? Yes. So, and I, but I'm just saying, I feel like that would take this to the next level. All right, let me let me know where you want me to pour it over the whole thing. Uh, yeah, baby. All right, let's. So we've had this ghost pepper sauce before. It's not. It wasn't that hot. No, right? it wasn't really hot at all. Yeah. I mean, it was good though. It was Ooh, very good. Talk about some loaded fries right now. I know. Um, we had it with the nuggets. We had actually when we when we reviewed the bourbon burger. Yes. Actually, we did. <laughs> okay. Do you want to go first? Um, no, no, you go first. Okay. Um, I was also going to say, you guys, I haven't really talked about this, and this is really important. Let me show you something. Wendy's, to me, has the best fries. Out of all the fast food places, I think Wendy's is my favorite. Mm. Now, a lot of people are going to tell me I'm crazy. Some people recently said it was their worst. Really? Mm -hmm. <laughs> Listen, guys. My opinion matters. Mm. <laughs> is it good? Mm. Is it good? Okay. But you do like their fries? I like their fries. Mm. I can, I can, no, I can't see how people think it's their worst, but I can see how you might not like it. You know, you might like McDonald's better mm -hmm. or Burger King better. Um, but for me, it's, it's, yeah, I, I like these fries. Okay. Nice. Let me. So it's got some cheddar cheese on the bottom, some mm. melted cheese on top, Look some crispy that. bacon, and then Ooh. put the ghost pepper sauce on top. Mm. And tell me that does not hit. Mmm. It that gives, hits. It gives it a kick. Now, if you don't want any heat, just maybe get some ranch and put a little ranch on top. Yeah, instead of the mm -hmm. ghost pepper sauce. That, that sauce really made it good. It did. 
That added a lot to it. Or you could even put some barbecue sauce on that. But I do think putting a sauce over these Ooh, fries makes it really is, good. Is the way to go. You're welcome. Mm -hmm. So these were really good. I like these loaded fries a lot. Mm -hmm. Honestly, I know we were reviewing today, but had we not have been reviewing and just went to Wendy's, mm -hmm. I would have got their chili um, baked Cheese potato. Fries? Oh, their baked potato. Mm. I know. Our chili baked potato was so good. I can't believe we're back again doing this so soon <laughs> with Wendy's, but we had to. And we're going to go again for breakfast mm. because we've only done breakfast, I think, once, and I don't remember it really. Mm -hmm. um, so I'm excited to try it again. Mm, what do you give these fries on one to ten? Those are actually really good. Mm -hmm. I think I'm giving those an eight. Mm -hmm. Those are very good, especially but it's it's. I mean, Look I guess this. I would have wanted to taste it without the sauce because mm. I'm sure it would've been very good too. But it's like you an still eight. Can. Over, oh yeah, I guess there's a little bit. Mm. I got mellow yellow. Mm. I haven't had this in a long time, so mm. I'll try it out. I'll give it an eight and a half. Mm. Mm. Super good. Wow. Mm. <laughs> mm. So, what was your favorite out of the two things? The fries or the burger? <laughs> the bur <laughs> <laughs> I know you know the, the burger was fine. Mm -hmm. It just didn't wow me. I like the fries. Yeah, me too. Me too. Um, I'm a little sad. I'm a little sad. Yeah, no, it's okay. Because I was really thinking that... It was going to be, like, really good. And, I, I mean, to yeah. be honest, I've never really had a Wendy's burger... Where I was kind of like, ah, it's just kind of decent. I really like their burgers a lot. Mm -hmm. You probably think this one's decent. But I gotta have this fry discussion. Okay. We gotta have this fry discussion. You guys, <laughs> these are the best fries. Let me try the fry by itself. I want, okay, well, these are, these technically aren't made the best. But, <laughs> but what, when they're today? made the best, yeah. Wendy's is the best fries. Yeah, they're not made the best. They're a little stale. But listen, this don't. Don't judge Wendy's by these fries. These are very stale. <laughs> they're stale. Yes. <laughs> but when you have them when they're not the stale, no. they're nice. I, I don't know. They're just they're just nice and like flexible and like they're chewable and not they're just, today. <laughs> you think right these now are better? These are better than McDonald's fries. Not today. If I took these to McDonald's, yeah, McDonald's definitely <gasps> killing these. Should we do a French fry blindfold taste test? Oh, we should. Do you think you do good at it? Yes. I you don't think know. <laughs> <laughs> we should definitely do that. I you would kill to? it. What do you? You think you would do well? Probably not, because I don't get fries a lot. Yeah, that's true. I usually like to just get the mm -hmm. entree by itself. No, I say that, but I don't know how I would do. Probably pretty bad. Um, but that's good, because then we could do like Carl's Jr., mm -hmm. Burger King, mm -hmm. McDonald's. Uh, these Wendy's, of course. If you want to see French fry, um, yes, Bible taste, taste us. let us know. Actually, let us know that for sure, because mm -hmm. I think that would be a lot of fun. Yeah. Um, but what do you, what's your favorite fries out of all of them? I mean, McDonald's hits. Yeah. Hold on, hold on, hold on. I like seasoned fries, though. So yeah. I like Arby's seasoned fries, and I like Jack in the Box. Oh, seasoned fries. yeah. You like oh, Jack in the and Chick-fil-A waffle fries. Oh. I mean, come yeah. on. Those okay, are way well, better. I wasn't thinking Chick-fil-A. <laughs> Chick-fil-A fries are the I best. still like these better than Jack in the Box's fries. Mm -hmm. um, you don't like season fries. Oh. Yeah. Jack in the Box regular fries. Regular fries, mm -hmm. yes. I like these better than Jack in the Box regular fries. Yeah. I like them better than Burger King. Mm -hmm. uh, what other? Carl's Jr. I don't remember what Carl's Jr. tastes like I, off the top. Uh, off the top. Ditto. I haven't eaten them enough times. Ditto. So I'm going to say we'll see with <laughs> Carl's Jr. But McDonald's, I like McDonald's fries a lot. Mm -hmm. But you guys, uh, what is that uh, movie called? Super Size Me? Yeah. Man, that movie like really like shook me up. It like, did. To the point where I honestly, subconsciously like in my mind, it's hard for me to eat McDonald's sometimes. Jamil does not like yeah. to eat McDonald's. That's it's, true. We've done it a lot. We've done it a lot. But every time we do it, Jamil will always like protest. Yeah, it's... In <laughs> some way, shape, or form. Subconscious, like not even... Yeah, mm -hmm. subconsciously, it definitely mm -hmm. like yep. made me think about McDonald's. Yes. And it's funny because I guarantee you like these other fast food places are very similar They're all in like what that. they do. Yeah. Oh, yeah but sure. it's specifically McDonald's that did that, you know, in my mm, mind. I agree. Um, <sighs> it's let, crazy. let us know who you think is the best French fries. If you think yep. Jamil's tripping on these Wendy's French fries. I can't be tripping. Let him know. This is true. It's stale. This one is stale. <laughs> no question. <laughs> I'm actually pretty upset. 
<laughs> because when they're not stale, they're the best. You're so cute. They are, I think. I'm actually pretty upset. You're so cute. <laughs> <laughs> okay, cool. Well, anyways, this right. is fun to try. And let us know, again, if you like this burger and yeah. what you give it on a 1 to 10. Mm -hmm. And let us know what you think are the best french fries. True. And once again, guys, still try it out for yourself. See uh -huh. if you like it. Um, shout out to everyone that suggested it because we're definitely happy that we did try it yes, out. Yes, and if so. there's any new fast food uh, you know, places that let us know. have new items... Fast food places mm -hmm. that have new items, let us know. Absolutely. Because uh, we'd love to always check those out. So. Very true. Okay, we're going to run some errands today. It's a beautiful day. Uh -huh. We're excited. It's the weekend. Yep. It is nice, yeah. So it was hard finding shade actually for it was hard finding shade today, but we did, yeah. That's right. I think we're gonna go maybe look at some mattresses today. Oh yeah, uh, just to see what kind we like. <laughs> That's right. Uh, for our big move, there's a mattress. Uh, what is it called? Mattress firm. Mattress firm, yeah. So we're gonna go we're in here. Take and a look. Maybe take a nap or something like that. I want to look bed. at a sleep number bed too. Oh, sleep numbers. I swear they're like one of the best. Let's do that. Yeah, we got to definitely check, okay, check out cool. some number. Okay. Don't, Don't forget, forget to, to like, like comment, subscribe, share. Sharing is caring. Let the K and let the fam know. Let them know. What is it? <laughs> Can you not? Sorry. Let's... I thought I could do it. <laughs> <laughs> you did. You did. Okay. Let your friends and family know what the K and J fam are doing. And until next time, we hope you have a wonderful day, evening, or night. Whatever, whatever time it is, is out there, there we'll, we'll see you in our next, next video. video. So that was the easy part. <laughs> <laughs> Peace. Peace